Hi, I'm Bill DeWeese, and welcome back to my 5 VO Tips in 5 Days. Today is tip number 5, and today is the day. I am launching my VoiceOver Black Friday sale early, officially at noon today at voblackfridaysale.com. Over 30 hours of training content to help you build a profitable, a lucrative voiceover career. It's broken down into very specific uh, objectives and strategies, tips, tricks, all the things that you need to be successful. So I'm really excited. I think you will agree that it's a phenomenal value. So again, you can check it out at voblackfridaysale.com. Uh, so now let's get to, to tip number five. And tip number five is this. How do you know what to lead your voiceover demo off with? As we all know, your voiceover demo is absolutely critical, particularly your commercial demo. And the very first segment, the first selection of copy that you have on that demo is absolutely critical. And let me tell you why. Because more times than not, the person listening to that demo won't get past the first few seconds. You'll probably, if you get five seconds, consider yourself pretty lucky. You might not get that much. And let me get, and if that surprises you, think about it for a second. Imagine when you're sitting down for the evening to watch a little television and you've got your cable remote in your hand and you're scanning channels. How long does it take you to decide whether you want to watch something or not? Now, I want you to imagine the people who are listening to your demo, they're not even seated in a relaxing, chilled environment like you would be watching TV. This is work. There's a lot of pressure. There's a lot of, a lot of uh, demos to, to be listened to, usually. And so usually within a few seconds, that particular client or agent or whoever will have a pretty good idea as to whether you are the right person um, for their consideration or not. So you've got all of maybe three to five seconds to let them know who you are. That being said, my suggestion is that those first three to five seconds of your demo better represent you at your best. Your what we'll call money read, uh, the read that people will probably come to you more for, for more often than anything else. Don't lead with something that perhaps would be better placed later on in your demo that might be a little bit more on the periphery of what you would do on a regular basis. Like, like let me give you, for instance, my very first commercial demo back when I first started, uh, made the big mistake of having my demo lead off with this big, powerful, um, it was a car commercial. And so it was me being really gritty and, and as big as I, as I possibly could. And, um, what happened is over time, I realized, and the purpose of it was to grab attention right up front. But what I found through time was that that was not my money read, meaning that is not what I was, it's not what I was best at, and that's not what most people hire me for. Most people hire me for my friendly, accessible guy next door kind of thing. As unglamorous as that may be, what you hear right now, this is what people hire me for. This is who I am. This is what I do. So now if you were to listen to my to my demo, you will hear the first few seconds, me reading copy that sounds very similar to the way I'm talking to you right now. So uh, with the help of a coach, you can better determine where your money read might lie, but it's probably going to be someplace where you're comfortable and where people, if you have any experience doing this at all, where people hire you and they ask for you to do those kind of scripts, but start with where you naturally live what comes more natural to you, because that most likely will be your strength. That's how your demo should start. That will help guarantee that you get the attention that you deserve so that you can get the work that you deserve. Hey, thanks for checking out these video tips. It's been a fun five days. And again, with five tips that I hope you find very useful and that you put into practice within your voiceover career. And hey, don't waste any time. Get over to VO Black Friday sale right now and check it all out. I do wish you great success and a very, for my friends here in the U.S., a very happy Thanksgiving holiday weekend. Take care.